In this video, I'll show you how to connect your HP DeskJet 3700 series, or like this one, the 300-772 printer, to your phone. It could be an Android phone or iPhone. It's exactly the same process that we'll show you right now. So let's get started. The first thing you need to do is to take your phone and go into the Play Store or the App Store, and you'll need to download the HP app. Just go in the search bar and type HP Smart, okay? And here we go, it's this one, made by HP Inc. Just install the app. Now, before opening the app, you just downloaded, you're gonna go over here and you notice on the printer, there is this X button and under it, there's another button that looks like uh, the wireless button. Take your finger and press both at the same time and keep them pressed, okay? And you'll see this power button flashing, then you can release it. So let's do it together. Keep it pressed. The power button is now flashing. I can release them. The power button will flash a few more times and will stay light up like this. This means that we entered the pairing mode. So now, you're gonna take your phone and open the app, the HP Smart app we just downloaded. And well, I already logged into my HP account. This is another printer I have. But if you don't have an HP account, I'll tell you right away, you won't be able to print from your phone. This is a decision HP made. I know it's very unpopular. I don't know why they're doing this. I mean, it's probably marketing purpose but you absolutely need to create or log into an existing HP account to be able to use uh, your phone to print wirelessly. In my case, I already logged in. In your case, you'll need to log in or to create a new account. Now, next step is to go into your internet settings of your iPhone or Android phone where you see all the networks around you and you're gonna select HP Setup DeskJet 3700 series. Tap on it to connect. Then go back into the app you just open, and you're gonna tap the plus sign over here. If you don't see it, no worries. It will have a big add a new printer over here, a big button you can press as well. Then from this screen, you're gonna select add printer and your HP DeskJet should appear in this list. Tap on it. This way it will be added to your phone. Now it's telling me that the tray is empty and I need to put paper to start printing. This is what I will do right now. I'll insert some paper. And I will extend this tray over here. All right, now we can use the phone to print and I'll show you how to do it. Again, you need to be logged into your HP account to do everything that I'll show you next. So from the main menu, you're gonna go down until you see print documents over here. Tap on it. Here you have to select if you want to print a PDFs or text documents or a photo. I want to print a text document, so I'll, print, I'll press the PDF here and it will give you uh, the files that are on your device itself, what are um, on the memory. Every file here are on my phone. I'll select one, let's say this one. Now to print the document, you have the print button over here on the lower left side. The first time I've used this to print a document with this printer, it asked me to download another HP app that, was, uh, that I needed to make this happen. If they ask you to download the other HP app, no problem, just uh, go back on your home Wi-Fi and download the app they ask you there. If not, just tap print here. It will tell you 
it will ask you to say how many copies you want do you want it to be in color and all the other settings of here just confirm that this is what you want in my case i just want it in black and white so i'll press black and white and when you're ready just press the small icon here the blue one it will send wirelessly and the printer will start doing its job Here we go. This is the page that was on my document. It's perfect. From now, you can print again if you want. You can even exit this by pressing the back button. To use the scanner function, you're going to go from the main menu down until you see printer scan. Tap on it. You can close this window. You're going to take the paper that you want to scan. Let's say it's this one. And well, the scanner is over here. This is the slot for the scanner where the paper goes. Put it facing upwards. Just put it at the entrance over here. And on the app itself, you're going to press this button here. The printer will try to take the, pic the paper. You can just give it a push to help it. And it will take it automatically from now and do the scanning. After a few seconds, you'll see the scan appearing on your phone. And from here, you can adjust the boundaries, just like it tells you here. It means that you can drag these blue corners around the actual paper. Because the scanner doesn't uh, know the difference between your paper and um, what it just tried to scan over here. It was just blank. And from now, you can print what you just scanned but you can also share it by typing, tapping here. You can also just save it on your phone by pressing the save button.